Democrats and centrists listen up. New York City Mayor Eric Adams stated he will no longer allow single Latino refugees to have housing after a 60-day notification to vacate. The mayor stated his reason is because he wanted to make room for refugees with children. Though I commend his actions for not wanting to see Latino children on the streets, I believe you can't just throw out refugees regardless of their situation. They need the proper aid in order to become productive members of society. As many of you know, I am an independent and centrist, but as we are all aware, Republicans cannot be trusted to be civil human beings when it comes to Latino migration policy, thus leading our community to rely on fellow centrists and Democrats to have the intelligence and compassion to help those in need. With that said, we cannot turn our backs on our migrant brothers and sisters. They simply want an opportunity to work and rebuild their lives, which is why we cannot abandon cities like New York and other so-called sanctuary cities who are doing God's work per se by acting as a beacon of hope in an increasingly racist landscape. New York State and the federal government needs to step up and provide the funds needed to assist NYC. It must be important to note that no one had any issues shelling out billions of dollars in funds for the tens of thousands of Ukrainian refugees a few months back. So there is absolutely no excuse for not helping out these new Latino arrivals who are simply escaping extreme poverty, dictatorships, violent gangs, civil wars, and so much more. I wholeheartedly stand in solidarity with these migrants as they are simply coming back to a land that was stolen from them to begin with. If people don't like that fact then tough. I do not care about anyone's negative feelings on this topic. If you are not fully or partially Native American like many of us Latinos then I don't need to hear your anti-immigration opinion. Never forget that unlike us, their European ancestors came into our land uninvited. Unlike them, we have always been here and we will continue to be here whether they like it or not.